I'm a board certified orthopedic surgeon who uh, practices here in St. Charles County on staff at both uh, Progress West Hospital and Barnes Jewish St. Peter's. In addition to being board certified in orthopedic surgery, uh, I uh, spent an additional year of my training uh, doing a fellowship in uh, sports medicine. Uh, there are a lot of uh, what we call subspecialists who are specialists who do additional training to um, become even more proficient and uh, more of an expert in a certain field. I chose, chose sports medicine. I did my sports fellowship at Methodist Sports Medicine in Indianapolis uh, in 2007 where I had the opportunity to um, to be one of the team fellows for the Indianapolis Colts and they happened to win the Super Bowl that year so that was a lot of fun for me. So uh, in terms of experience in choosing a physician, someone who's had the opportunity to work with professional as well as recreational athletes and getting them back on the field or getting you back playing pickup basketball on the weekends, that's really my, my main goal. You might think about choosing a physician who's most like you, someone who has the same interests possibly, uh, and someone who can understand the things uh, that you want answered about your particular complaint. Um, I see a lot of endurance athletes and runners in, in my practice, and um, I'm an endurance athlete myself, and so they, they don't want to hear stop running or stop competing. They want to know how they can do it safely and how they can do it uh, without long-term problems and that's really my goal. So if someone was going to look for a physician, uh, they may want to uh, seek out one who has similar interests as, as, um, as they do. I think I find most re rewarding is uh, seeing, seeing the results of uh, caring for patients, um, whether it's uh, you know, getting the high school kid back on the field or um, allowing someone else to walk without knee pain after a uh, replacement. Um, it's very gratifying to see patients um, happy about their outcomes and uh, return to their function, whether it's you know, high-level athletic function or simple activities around the house, which I find most gratifying. In my practice, I think healthy living takes on a little bit of a more uh, advanced definition because the majority of my patients are already active. So a lot of them like to participate in uh, athletic endeavors, whether it's uh, running or uh, recreational activities. Um, in terms of uh, those patients, I just say one thing that I see that can continue a healthy uh, lifestyle for an active individual is to continue to be flexible, whether it's yoga, uh, a daily stretching program, whatever works best for you, I think it's important to be flexible in order to continue your activity of choice. If uh, you're not as active and uh, you're still having uh, questions or concerns about how to live a healthy lifestyle, uh, certainly things in moderation is always um, uh, a good, where to, good place to start. Uh, in terms of knee or hip pain, weight reduction. You put about seven times your body weight across uh, your knee uh, during a step. Uh, so uh, I'll let you do the math and you can figure out that seven times one pound would be seven less pounds if you'd lost one pound. And over time, you can actually make your knees or hips feel better by weight reduction. As a uh, fellowship trained sports medicine physician, part of my job is uh, not only to see uh, patients in the office and treat sports injuries, but also to have a presence on the field. Uh, currently, I'm the team physician for Fort Zomalt West High School, uh, as well as uh, the um, professional uh, development league for uh, MLS uh, soccer team, uh, the St. Louis Lions, which uh, play at Tony Glavin Soccer Complex in the summer. I also uh, have a relationship with Lindenwood University where I uh, help uh, some of their athletic trainers uh, fulfill the, a rotational requirement by uh, rotating through my office. Uh, and also uh, observing some surgeries um, to help them better understand how to treat the athletes and how they are treated on the other side of, of the field. <music>